don't underestimate the anger of the back of your head, your eyes in your posture, especially with the forward neck kyphosis, the eyes, whether they're looking down at our phone, and that's really kind of creating that forward neck kind of collapse, right? Which is increasing the weight of the head on the whole structure, causing the, the pain and the tension in the, in the neck sometimes, how that is essentially kind of a lever we have at the top of our spine um, as we're doing different movements and, and breath work. And then adding in the eyes in this, and the eyes actually have connections all the way through to the oxypaddle, and you can actually feel your eyes in the back of your head when you're moving them left to right. So by holding the phone more vertically, or even more with that chin tucked and your eyes a little bit higher, you're actually kind of creating that elongation that I, I love to see and love to do in static postures or these dynamic movements that we're doing for posture correction as well.